Hello and welcome back to our channel. I'm Danish, and you are watching Iraqi Dinar YouTube channel. Hopefully you all will be fine let's start today. Iraq's financial landscape is currently undergoing a significant transformation, marked notably by the resignation of Central Bank Governor Ali Alalek. This event is sparking considerable discussion and speculation within financial circles. Alalek's departure is seen by many as a pivotal moment, potentially signaling a shift towards greater economic stability and reform. The resignation has been widely reported and confirmed, causing a wave of optimism among finance professionals and investors alike. This change in leadership is not just a routine administrative shift it represents a crucial juncture in Iraq's ongoing efforts to stabilize and revitalize its economy. For years, Iraq has struggled with economic challenges and currency instability. Alalek's tenure was often criticized for its lack of effective action towards meaningful reform, leading to widespread frustration and calls for change. His resignation is viewed by many as a necessary step to clear the way for new leadership that could implement more effective monetary policies. Prime Minister Mohammad Shia al Sudani has previously emphasized that decisions regarding currency rates rest with the Central Bank of Iraq, CBI, making the role of the new CBI leadership critical. The anticipation surrounding this change is palpable. The financial community is keenly watching how the new leadership will approach economic reforms and whether it will finally address long standing issues such as currency devaluation and inflation. With Alalek out of the picture, there is a renewed sense of hope that the CBI will have the freedom to enact policies that could stabilize and potentially revalue the Iraqi dinar. This move is not only significant for Iraq but could also have broader implications for the regional economy. Investors and financial analysts are speculating about the potential outcomes of this shift. New leadership might bring fresh perspectives and strategies, leading to more consistent and predictable economic policies. This could encourage investment, both domestic and foreign, contributing to job creation and overall economic growth. Furthermore, any stabilization of the Iraqi dinar would likely boost confidence among investors and the general public, fostering a more stable and prosperous economic environment. The social impact of these changes cannot be understated. A more stable economy could improve the livelihoods of ordinary Iraqis, offering better job opportunities, higher wages, and improved access to essential goods and services. This potential for positive change is especially significant in a country where many families are struggling financially. However, it's important to approach these developments with a degree of caution. While the resignation of Alalek is a step in the right direction, meaningful change often takes time, particularly in complex political and economic systems. Observing how the new leadership navigates key issues will be crucial in determining the actual impact of these changes. In the broader context, there are also concerns about Iraq's geopolitical stance. Some voices suggest that if Iraq continues to align more closely with Iran, it could face negative repercussions, potentially undermining the benefits of internal economic reforms. This adds another layer of complexity to the situation as the country's policy direction could influence the overall effectiveness of its financial strategies. The recent developments, including the reduction in the number of banks participating in currency auctions and the dramatic drop in auction volumes, highlight the urgent need for reform. The auctions, which are critical for currency exchange and economic liquidity, have seen a significant reduction, with only one bank involved and minimal transaction volumes, this situation underscores the need for a more robust and effective monetary policy to address Iraq's financial challenges. Overall, the resignation of Alalek and the potential for new economic policies present a critical opportunity for Iraq. As the country stands on the brink of potential change, it is essential for stakeholders to stay informed and engaged, keeping an eye on both the opportunities and challenges that lie ahead.